Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Houston News. Today is what, April the 13th, 2021. We are here to give y'all a price prediction update into the market for till right now. If today's the first time ever viewing our content and you all appreciate our videos and how we're giving you all the prediction as to where to expect price to go before you head out, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, also share the video. And I need to remind you to continually come back to this channel because you're this is the only location to where we're going to give you all the heads up as to where to anticipate where prices are likely to go in the market. Now, last time I did our video for Tilray was on March the 8th, you know, 2020. And for us, we're an organization that's going to be fully transparent with you in regards to what our expectations were and how the market actually performed against our expectations. So you can see right here. On March the 5th, we expected Tilray to give us some weakness, right? And look at how long it took for the market in Tilray to come all the way back down here to our ultimate TP price of about $17.10. It took a very long time. From the beginning of March all the way to mid-April, this market in Tilray has just been, generally it has just been trading sideways, right? But it's been going lower as it's been trading sideways. You guys can see that. Okay. So it took a long time. That's one of the hardest things about being in the market is the timing aspect. We were already in position into the market in Tilray on March the 5th. Under the premise that the market was going to continue to decrease in value, but no one can give you the time frame as to when it will actually get to the point to where you expect the price to be. From the beginning of March all the way here <laughs> to mid-April, it took for the market in Tilray just for us to grab that 20% out the market. You know what I'm saying? So it took us a while. The market actually has given us a little bit of extra juice. We've had our restriction area around $28.25. We should have increased it a little bit higher. That was the only problem that we've had in our prediction is that we didn't have our restriction area correct. But nevertheless, we still saw the market weakness enter into till rate on this day, which was on March the 16th. All right, so congratulations. I mean, if you all expected the market and till rate to drop in price as well, then you at least could have gotten out 20%. Market came there yesterday. So let's take that away because we need to talk about some things here into the market in Tilray that would substantiate what occurred. I mean, we really need to pay attention to that because we've seen a lot of volume come in yesterday in the market in Tilray. Okay. Now let's follow the trend though. Is this the trend into the market in Tilray? Is this the actual trend that the market in Tilray is following? It's pretty accurate, right? We have all of these trading days right here in the market in Tilray to where the market could not even break above that descending line. And then again here. So we have two opportunities to where we've seen the trap try to break that price above the descending line and it has been unsuccessful. Okay. Now, this area right here is trying to be maintained as support. So let me show you that. And that is precisely where the market closed at yesterday. So based off the volume, based off how the market in Tilray closed, I'm not really expecting the market to hold that price. Not there at seven dollars and what, 15, 20 cents. I'm not really seeing the market holding that as an area of support. OK. So let's zoom out just a tad. And you can see that the next area of support is not that far though. Maybe around $15.75 will be the next area of support in the market in Tilray. So let me look at this on a three day, two day time frame. And yeah, definitely I'm still seeing the weakness here into the market in Tilray. So I'm not going to expect any strength to really come into the market for this particular stock uh, we're going to look forward to try to come 
and hold support initially around 16. But as I told you back here, support is going to try to come in around $15.15. Okay. And then anywhere lower than that is going to be a bigger movement to the downside, more likely towards $12.25. So we're looking at two areas of support now that we're going to expect the trap to try to come in and prop the price up. First area is going to be right there around um, $15. Next area is going to be around 12. Okay. So based off these varying time frames from the two day, the three day, and even here on the five day, the market until rate is giving us some weakness. Okay. So we got three areas. I'm going to first expect the trap to try to come in and prop up the price into right around $16. Then the next level is going to be 15 and then the third level is going to be 12. Okay. Those are the three areas that we're going to focus in on to see the market trap come in and try to prop up the price. Okay. And again, this is the area of dissension. The market currently is it a downtrend? And until we see the market actually break the downtrend for Tilray, we're going to continue to go lower in price. Okay. So now we said that $16 will be the location to where we would come in and TP out the market, some of it, some profit, which would give us at least what 8.16% profitability. We said the next area is going to be around $15. Let me see. Let me go back there. Yeah, right there around $15.20. Okay. That's the ultimate place that we're going to expect the market to try to come in till right and hold some support. Okay. And then let me bring this down just a tad. Right there. So we're in position. This is going to be our expected price movement in Tilray. We're still expecting the market to give us some weakness. It is definitely still entrenched. First area to P is around 16. Next one is around $15 and 15 cents, give or take, right around that vicinity there. And that's it. There's nothing confusing about it. Once you understand what the price bars and volume means, you can actually call the market. You can actually see where the trap is trying to take the price for these stocks. All without being confused so like i told you earlier if you all want to participate and call in the markets drop us a comment in the comment section tell us your price prediction for tilray and make sure before you head out you hit the like button share the video and also subscribe and make sure you come back for more of our price predictions within the stock market make sure you maintain a profitability and as always trade different